A new force object tool has been added in Particle Illusion 3. In this scene, we have a simple point emitter that's shooting particles in a straight line. But what if we'd like that stream of particles to change direction as they travel? We'll rewind the scene and add a force object to the stage. You can resize a force by clicking on the square in the bottom corner and dragging it. Now when the scene is played, the particles begin to turn to the right as they enter the area defined by the force. Let's take a closer look at the force itself. There's an arrow in the center of the box pointing right. That is the direction that the force is pushing. You can change that by selecting the direction property from the hierarchy window and changing it. The arrow rotates to show what direction the force is now pushing in. The strength property increases or decreases the amount of pressure that the force is putting on the particles, speeding them up or slowing them down. The more strength that's applied, the more the stream of particles will bend. The size of the force object also affects how the particles are affected. The longer that the particles are inside the box, the more force is applied to them, and the more the direction changes. The angle property rotates the entire force object. In this example scene, the angle of the forces were animated to match the spinning blades of the windmill. You can animate any property of the force so particles can be pushed in different directions with different strengths at different times.